Welcome back to the memes. That's Frank. I'm not the expert, and today we're playing some NCAA Football 06. The reason I wanted to venture back to NCAA 06 is because I wanted to play their Road to Glory. But actually, back in this day, it was called Race for the Heisman. I'm 25 now, but in 2006, I was about 10 years old. So everybody who loved this game back in the day, sorry for making you feel 90 years old. I've heard only good things from this game, and I've always wanted to try to go back to the PS2 era to play some of the greatest NCAA football games ever created, at least based on their rating. Like, it's impressive how deep this game was back in the day. If we go look at the game features, you can create a school, you can create a sign, you got the FBS rosters, you got the FCS rosters. So it's not just FCS West, you're gonna go against an actual school here, like Alabama A&M or something. You even got historic rosters. 1985 Alabama. Best of the best from 1998. Like, that's pretty cool. Oh, all Washington. But like, all Auburn. You got Pat Sullivan, probably. You got good old Bo Jackson out there. 97 speed, 95 acceleration, 99 break tackle. That'd be fun to play with. With. That's really cool detail that they added it in here. You got 2004 USC. That's got to be Reggie Bush right there. Appalachian State. Quarterback 56 overall. I forget which year they beat Michigan, but imagine this team beating Michigan. Always love a major upset like that. It's one we'll never forget. I'm not playing the dynasty mode right now, but if there's enough support for it, maybe I'll give it a try because you can create a team in this game. I'll set the bar pretty high and see if you guys can get there. If we can get around 30,000 likes, I'll give dynasty mode a try in this game. This video is brought to you by HelloFresh. HelloFresh is a meal kit delivery service that makes cooking at home fun, easy, and affordable. I love HelloFresh because you don't have to make any trips to the grocery store with a massive list of groceries and ingredients when you have no real plan. With HelloFresh, you can save your time and energy for yourself and your family. HelloFresh always swoops in with the clutch five-star recipes that have the perfect amount of ingredients delivered straight to your door. So you'll waste less food and have an amazing meal ready in an average of 30 minutes. HelloFresh is also also great at catering to specific diets and restrictions. Whether it's vegan or mega protein for the meatheads trying to get swole, HelloFresh has an option for you. The meal you see me making today is the special sauce house burgers with garlic potato wedges and grilled onion. It's always fun to make burgers, but with HelloFresh's ingredients in that special sauce, it just put it over the top for me. A plus. Take advantage of the special offer right now by using my custom link in the description below and using my coupon code NTE14 to get 14 free meals across your first five HelloFresh boxes plus free shipping. Once again, that's code NTE14. 14 for up to 14 free meals across your first five HelloFresh boxes. Thanks again to HelloFresh for sponsoring this video. Time to start the race for Heisman. Perform well in summer camp for a scholarship, track your progress using the Heisman hype meter, and win the Heisman and get drafted into the pros. All right, everybody over here, over here right now, listen up. If you're here, it means you want to play ball after you graduate. You guys all could have been studs on your high school team, but you need to show the college scouts in the stands today. You've got what it takes to be part of their programs. This is your proven ground, guys. If you do well today, colleges will be fighting to recruit you. When your position's called, men, get out there. You know what it means to leave it on the field? Leave it. Show us you deserve to be here. All right, so I guess we don't technically play our high school. We're just doing like a little summer camp thing, which is fine with me. Sometimes the high school games can kind of drag on. But I want to be a running back. I've been quarterbacks multiple times. I've been a receiver. Haven't played any defense on the channel, I don't think. So maybe we'll do that eventually. But I want to be a running back in this one. Sprinting with the X button. That's how you know we're in the past. Let's do a little juke. Stepping over him. Buster Cherry's already got a touchdown. Jukes are kind of overpowered in this game. I'm liking it. Just keep doing that little left juke. Everyone in the country is going to want us on their team. Look at that. Just the same move every time. Is it an exploit? Yes. Am I going to keep using it? Yes. Look, I only have this one Oklahoma drill for the rest of my life. I got to exploit it. Oh, that didn't work that time. We're going to have... If we're going to get 9 out of 10, that'll be good for me. Oh, and we made it work. 9 touchdowns out of 10. Everyone in the country wants us. USC, Oklahoma, and Louisville. But I don't think I'd have fun at USC. There's probably way too many good running backs already on that roster. I kind of want to go to a mid-level school. And I don't think I've done anything in the Big 12 so far on my channel. I think I'm going to go with Texas Tech because that way we get in the division with Oklahoma, Texas, Texas A&M, Oklahoma State, and Baylor. And they are number 21 in the country, so they're not a completely terrible team. But they're still not at the top. There's still room to grow there. And I like their jerseys. Red and black, it's always been my favorite. I'd like you to meet Buster Cherry. 
That name is not even remotely inappropriate. Don't even think about it that way. This is a family-friendly channel. So Buster is pretty tall. 6'1", 250 pounds. He is a unit. He's going to be a dominant running back here in college football. We're trying to race for that Heisman. He's going to be not only swole, can break tackles, but he can maneuver around you. Got some good agility and athleticism. Face protector? I never knew you could do these. You could wear it in the cold. That's pretty cool. I mean, we're, we're playing in Texas, so it's not like we're ever going to wear it, but I'm going to have it just in case we ever do. Put on the mouthpiece because that's a feature. This neck roll doesn't look as goofy as they usually have it. We could go with turf tape, but I think I like the armband a little bit better. So my overall rating from the get-go is 84. That's honestly way higher than I expected, but I'm not going to complain about it. I don't think I can manipulate any of these. It'd be kind of cool if I could customize it. Catching is kind of weak. Carrying is high. Speed 8, 88. Still some pretty good agility at 90. Break tackle 86. This is all probably because I played pretty well in that opening. I wonder if I played like crap if it would make me even worse. Maybe we should do that. I don't know. But this is my first time playing through this, so I'm going to stick with the good stuff. You have just created your player and race for the Heisman. Your dorm room is ready for you to move in, and it's time for you to get ready for your freshman season. If you can become a legend at your school, you can continue your player's career in Madden NFL 06, or you can stay in the college ranks as a coach in Dynasty mode. Now that is cool. Track your progress to greatness using the Heisman hype meter. Hit the practice feel to improve your game faster, perform well in big games to become a legend in your program, and be sure to check your mailbox to read letters from your fans. Oh man, they really gave me the cinder block walls. We are starting from the bottom, even though we're an 84 overall player. The schedule, we can check our closet. A little tiny closet in the corner, but that's all we need. We can check out our attributes and stuff, see those progress. Is that our girlfriend in the corner of the computer? She is hideous. I'm going to have to pause it right there. I don't even want to know her name because she's not going to be around here long. That's got to be an Olga or something. That's barely human. But I've heard about this. I've heard that you start out with just a hideous girlfriend and she can get progressively more and more attractive. Like you'll get a different girlfriend the better you perform in the game, which is kind of funny. Oh, our quarterback has a mullet. I dig that. And we got a freshman quarterback, 80 overall. He's going to be our long-term guy. Yeah, it looks like we're going to have some good quarterbacks. I am the number two on the depth chart. This guy at the top, 92 overall. So it's going to be tough to compete with him. He is a senior though. So my, I'm coming up soon. We got good receivers. Like, this looks like a pretty strong team. I think we'll have fun here. Good offensive line. Pretty solid defense. This Heisman watch looks kind of cool. Looks like Matt Leinart, I think, on here. And you get to see their actual player instead of just like a, a face thing. Is that Adrian Peterson? Oh, this is going to be fun. Reggie Bush. We got Vince Young. Oh, yeah, this is awesome. Fun era to jump into. We got a B-plus overall team, B-offense, B-defense, and B-plus special teams. Do we have fan mail? Hello, Buster. <laughs> Looks like it's written by a kid. I've heard nothing but good things about you since you have arrived on campus. It's good to hear that we have a class act like you around to keep these guys in line. Keep up the good work and best of luck. From Ben Blunt. Well, thanks, Ben. Very kind of you. Is that supposed to be my car in the background, too? Are they hinting that I'm going to get some fancy car if I get better? They're just handing it under the table. I like that I can change the playbook, too. So even if I'm at a school like Texas Tech that is mainly known for its passing attack, I can switch it to make it more of a rushing attack so I can get the ball more often. Ooh, we got Kirk Herbstreit, we got Brad Nessler, Lee Corso. I'm Brad Nessler, joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreit. Why is this presentation better than a lot Here's of the guys, future games? Just hold on to your seats because we've got an incredible matchup coming your way early in this college football season. Here come the Red Raiders. Oh, hell yeah. There's Buster Cherry in the back, I think. He's not a stud yet. People barely know him. He's a promising prospect, though. We're going to blow him out, Hoopla. He's a focused competitor, and he'll be ready to play. You're absolutely right. The Red Raiders, sweetheart. That's who I'm picking. No, oh, yeah, Lee Corso. You got to go with the Red Raiders. We don't even have a real mascot head in this game, I guess. The Golden Panthers come out of the Let's formation. pump up the crowd. Comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Gets the ball. Oh, he's heaving it. Oh, I got snagged on in the first play. Oh, I have no idea how to play on these old games. Longest pass in NCAA history right there. Whoops. Why'd you make me play defense? I can't do it. It says I can play or lock on, so maybe on offense I don't have to worry about passing. But on defense, we're going to be in trouble, lads. But it'll make it more fun. It'll be a real simulation of Big 12 football. Nothing but touchdowns. Single set backfield. Buster Cherry, first carry. Pretty good. Oh, you gotta block him. Oh, they're gonna make me throw. It's all good, though. We're getting the first down. We're gonna have to figure out this game at some point. Come on, Buster. Let's get your first touchdown. Come on, buddy. 68. You gotta block him. 
Oh, my ankle. Did you hear that snap? Oh, what a catch. The entire offense is going to be run through Buster. Mainly because we got to get him the Heisman. It's the only reason for this series to exist. Oh, that's got to be a face mask. Except that one all day. Oh, I'm getting sacked. We fumble it. We're going backwards. We lost the ball. We're really going to get wrecked by FIU, aren't we? I'm being humbled by these old games. It doesn't hold my hand anymore. I'm going to control the defensive line and never break away from it, because I am terrible. Number 16 has four receivers lined up here. Is he going to scramble out? Oh. The freshman makes the catch. What is this difficulty? Drop back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. Oh, you got to catch those. You know what's surprising about this old game is the crowd sound effects are actually pretty good. I would have thought the PS2 era would have been kind of dookie, but it's solid. Wants to throw outside. We are just getting wrecked. They go with the run. 14 to 0 already. It's going to be a brutal start to my career here. Oh my god. <laughs> He's already sacked us twice. The Red Raiders line up in the power eye formation. Ah, just nowhere to go. I don't even know the buttons to this game. I'm really just figuring it out as I go. They're not the same as modern games, and it's just all over the place. <laughs> Dive at his feet. Oh my, he's throwing it back to the quarterback. That was kind of cool. A lot of trick plays in this old game, I see. May have to exploit those later. Let's see if they look the wideouts way. He is in the zone. Oh, come on. You got to swat that out. Oh, he was out of bounds, too. We finally made a stop. It only took us an entire quarter. Oh, this is our chance. Finally, a big play for Buster. Hit him. All the moves. He's just dancing around him. He's gaining momentum. Oh, nearly threw a pick. See, this is why you shouldn't let me be the quarterback. Got to go to him. Oh, barely anything. Hit the tight end. Hell yeah. I kind of like the challenge in this game, though. I'm going to have to be on top of it. And I, like, this is my first time playing. We got fat guys in the stands. What more can you ask for? Just run it up the gut, Buster. Oh, yeah. See, we're getting better as the game goes along. He has eight carries for 22 yards, which is not an impressive stat line at the moment, but we'll get there. Good throw. And he fumbles it. Seriously? Can we not catch a break around here? Oh, nice play on the ball. We're slowing them down a little bit. Ooh, during a timeout, you can select a group to coach. I mean, I should have saved it for the offense, but yeah, let's keep it for the corners because they've been getting torched by this quarterback. The Red Raiders set up in the gun. Uh oh, high snap. Throw it on the run. Let's go. Number 10 comes to the line with three. He's wide open. Go, go, go. Three receivers. They'll throw on first down. Rolls right. Get rid of it. I said throw it out of bounds. Keep it on the ground again. Follow the blockers, but the blockers are terrible. Oh, he deflected it, and the guy still almost caught it. Florida International goes with the ace set here. Throws. Oh, I'm getting sauced. I keep turning backwards because I keep hitting the... I keep thinking the sprint button is the right trigger, but that is the strafe button. So I'm getting torched because I'm just bad at the game. I'm new to it. I'm sorry. They're not very creative. In their He's open. You don't need to be creative. We're going to get a touchdown. To the 20, to the 10. Finally, we've done it. We got a cannon. That's full of memes. Oh, no. 2v1. Whew, I am so bad at coverage in this game. It's not even funny. We're losing to an 0 and one team. We're ranked number 15 in the country. This would be a major win for them and an embarrassing loss for us. Oh, I just ran straight into him. That's my fault. He's got to be open. Get there. That's got to be enough. On fourth down. That's going to be a first. I <laughs> love the finger guns. I'm going to like it here at Texas Tech. Oh, we had that running back there at the fullback position. Oh, yeah. 2.4 yards per carry. Not a great start to his career, but he's a workhorse. 
We're going triangle. It's tipped up. We're trying to catch it, and we get hit again. Fourth and 21. Fourth and miles. He drops back. Looking. He rolls. Get rid of it. Oh my lord, he caught it. Fourth and 40 years into the future. Hi, mom. Send money. You didn't even put your Venmo on there, buddy. What is this, 2006? Texas Tech lines up with three receivers. He jukes. There he goes. Hell yeah, that was a great run. From the gun. He's wide open. Power through him. Most cases, this would be a fullback dive, but I got to get Buster Cherry this touchdown. He's in there. First one of his career. <laughs> Shoot the cannon. I'm having a ton of fun here. Like, we're getting getting smacked, but we're clawing our way back. It's not about your first girlfriend. It's about who you end up with at the end of the game. Number 16 comes to the line with three wide. With the Nuke him. Back to pass. Looks. He's got nobody. They're counting that as a fumble. Almost got to it. He's launching a deep. This has got to be a pick. He caught it? I'm furious, bro. Number one is fired. I'm taking back your Camaro. Florida International comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Oh, this guy's still catching it. Like, I feel like we should be there to pick it off at least. Setting up the play action. What a swat. Finally, we did something right in the secondary. They are going to try for the field goal. Don't know how good the kicking is in this game, so we'll see if he makes it. He looks like he's going to sink that. Yep. 24 to 14. It's still within reach, but we only have one quarter to try and come back here. Give me those blocks. Oh, we got one downfield. 24. Pick him up. Got that stiff arm. And that's a big time run for Buster Cherry. That's probably the best one he's had all day. Oh, yeah. They go with a toss. Ugh. For a big, strong dude, I think he would be better at stiff arming, but he's really not. Watch out for the man at wideout. He's feeling it right now. Oh, I threw it a little too early. Drops back to pass. That's got to be there. Oh, my. What is my quarterback doing? I feel like I'm throwing it at the right time. Doing a fake punt here. I didn't mean to select this, but we're doing it. The Red Raiders are lining up to punt it away. Gets it away. Get there. Oh my god, we did it. The fake punt works. Fake punts actually work in the old game. I love these old games. Look how wobbly that was. Punter still threw a money pass. Led the receiver perfectly. Now we're in business. Good, good. First down. Keep it going. He's averaging around four yards a carry, which is not bad for a freshman debut. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Rolls to the right. Let's just scramble the QB and try to not die. And now he's gonna run. He's it's gonna be enough for a first down. I love that hustle. Work from the They'll throw on first Good timing. Down the That's a first down. Let's see if they can take this one in for six. Oh my god, his spine just like one of those door blocker things. It just started bouncing around. Let's see if they can punch this one in. Play action. Run Roll in. To the right side. Touchdown quarterback. A little play action boot. And now it's a one score game again. They'll throw on first down. Steps up in the box. <laughs> the back hit is so brutal. I need the crowd here. Why are they quieting down? Come on, this is two minutes left in the game. We need to stop. Back to pass. He's going right. Ah, he's got a first down. They'll throw on first down. They do a screen pass. He fumbles it. They get it back. Come on, that was our chance. What a booming hit from 45. That was very clutch, but we couldn't capitalize. We sacked him. Perfect. Oh, he's doing some extra push-ups for the coach to show he did it right. I need number 88 to just make a big play again. He's been dominant. Over 100 receiving yards already. Oh, what a catch. That's a user catch. First one. That's huge. Okay, the safety on the left side is kind of pinched in. Come on, send it. He's got to get this one. He snagged it. Impact player over there. Hell yeah. How about that? We saw it pre-snap. We just sent it to the moon. Went up there 1v2. Snagged on him. And we're hopefully avoiding embarrassment here. Well, this number 83 guy just keeps catching on me. I don't know what to do about it. Oh, we smacked the quarterback. He drops back. Steps up in the pocket. Not getting through. That's not enough. Are they going to run it? We shut them down. How about the D-line? They're going to run it here on fourth down, and they get it, though. But they're taking their sweet time. They got 16 seconds left. Just keep them out of the end zone, and we're good. They're still running the ball. 
Weird strategy. They used their last timeout. Four seconds. We got to keep them out of the end zone. He won't throw it underneath because we're going to sack him. That's going to be GG's. We come all the way back. The fans had a heart attack. It was 21 to 0 at one point. But we finished the game 28 to 24, avoiding embarrassment in the season opener here in Lubbock, Texas. That was a really fun one, though. This game does provide a little bit of a challenge, and that was only FIU. I can't wait till we play some Big 12 opponents. Buster Cherry right there, getting hype. It's going to be a long story career for him. This was a good way to start it out with a comeback win against FIU at home. One game in and we already have an instant classic. Number one, greatest game of all time. Not a lot to compete with. The fans are probably furious because we had that close of a game against a much weaker opponent. But hey, the result is all that matters. We got the win. We're 1-0 to start the year. We ended up getting more passing yards than them by the end of the game. 336 to 334. We sacked them three times. Good thing they came in clutch situations. 6 of 10 on third downs. 3 of 3 on fourth down. That cannot go understated. Shout out to the punter. Shout out to all the times we converted on like 4th and 20. Converted every time in the red zone. We did have two turnovers, two fumbles early on in the game. We forced three fumbles, but we did not pick up any of them. As far as the individual stats, I really need to give these guys some names because quarterback number 10, wide receiver number 88, that's just going to be pretty forgettable for most of us. I will say though, quarterback had a pretty good game and so did the punter when he threw that one pass. Quarterback number 10 was 17 to 25, 322 yards, two touchdowns, zero interceptions. Buster Cherry, 23 attempts, 84 yards and one touchdown in his debut. He had a long of 18. He also had five catches for 66 yards though, so his total yardage on the game was pretty high. Wide receiver number 88 is clearly a star. All first team big 12, five catches, 145 yards, two receiving touchdowns. He was clutch. He's going to be a megastar throughout the series. 10 pancakes from right tackle number 75. Left in number two was putting in work. Four tackles for loss and three sacks in this game. I must say, this series is going to be shaping up to be a fun one. Did not expect that I would be controlling everyone on the team, but I guess they did not have the player lock feature too much in this old game. And will I ever clean up my room? Find out in next episode. If you'd like to see some more, please leave a like on the video. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing. It's completely free, and you can always unsubscribe later if you don't like me. And if you're already subscribed, I just want to say thanks for watching. Love you dudes. Anyways, that's pretty much all I got for this video. I want to say thank you guys so much for watching. You're all legends in my book, and as for me, I am Drew Morris, big old Drewski, not the expert. And I'll see all you guys in my next video. Peace.